Assalamu alaikum, you guys. Welcome back to our channel. Make sure to check out my Blue City Travel Guide located in the description box below. We went to Chef Shawin, aka the Blue City, this past weekend, and here is some of the scenery on our way. Once again, being in Morocco really reminds me of Colorado where I grew up and a lot of the scenery reminds me of being in the Rocky Mountains. Once we got there, we stayed in this really cute guest house. I really enjoyed the views from our room. This is some of them. was inside the guest house which was really comfortable and I took a little bit of footage and I would definitely recommend this guest house if you guys are ever in the Blue City. We went by the Kashba Museum and it was really nice. This little plaza reminded me so much of Boulder, Colorado. There was definitely a hippie vibe in this city. <laughs> broke our fast at this restaurant so you know we had to order like one of everything and it was nice because the mosque was right next to us There's something so special about Northern Moroccan oranges. They do not taste like any other oranges in the world.
I've noticed that wherever you go in Morocco, the animals are just so chill. After our little excursion of the Blue City, we went towards the Spanish Mosque and there was a waterfall here. It was really nice and peaceful. Once you pass the waterfall, we started our incline towards the Spanish Mosque and it was just so worth seeing the views that are up here. Again, the animals just be so chill and minding their own business. This is the view once you get to the top from the Spanish Mosque. And you guys, this view is just so breathtaking. If you're ever in Morocco, I really highly suggest coming to Chef Shawin and seeing this view for yourself in person. guys for watching make sure you like and subscribe